WROI News, connecting you with your local, statewide, and national leaders. This is WROI News. Ninety-two point one WROI. It's time now to take a look at your local news. News today is brought to you by Rochester Greenhouse. Send a fresh cut flower bouquet today and make someone's day. And by your Fulton County REMC, your Touchstone Energy Cooperative. Currently sitting at forty-two degrees under cloudy skies here in downtown Rochester. We'll have a look at your full weather forecast a little bit later on in your news. The Fulton County Commissioners met and signed an agreement with Miami County to house prisoners from the overflow at the jail. Commission President Brian Lewis was our guest on WROI and shared some of the details. Larry Jolly came in for the sheriff, brought an agreement that we'd approved last month, but we had some date changes on that, so we approved the interlocal agreement between Miami County and Fulton County. It's starting April 1st to December 31st of this year. We're guaranteed 30 beds to house inmates down there for $40 a day. So I think we have 20-some inmates down there currently, and, and we'll be, I think, pulling the inmates from, I think we had one or two left up in Steuben County and, and trying to get everybody back closer. The commissioners also signed a contract with SRKM to do some work around the courthouse, and Lewis told us about that as well. They're going to do some engineering work around the courthouse for us. We have a lot of issues with the concrete sidewalks around. They're old, coming apart, and they're becoming a hazard. And we have to do some issues with the steps around the courthouse. And a lot of the basement is under some of those steps, so we you know, to take the liability off the county, we need to have an engineering firm come in and engineer that for us. I think that contract was $10,500. Another contract the commissioners signed was to clean the courthouse, and Lewis filled us in on that. We signed a contract, proved one for Zakowski Construction to come in and power wash and clean the courthouse. It's starting to get a little discoloration. When it gets a little wet, it really shows right. up how we need that is. And a lot of money is kind of surprising, but there, there's a lot of work to get that high up oh, there with is. equipment that Absolutely. they have to lease. And, and that was a little over $40,000. So it's a, it, it just takes a lot to take care of these older right. buildings and, and the historical buildings that we have. And again, that was Fulton County Commissioner's President Brian Lewis. The Rochester School Board met and discussed the poor grades the school received on ISTEP after the company giving the test made a mistake in the math sections. Board President Brad Weaver was our guest on the WROI Schools Report and talked about efforts to correct the company's mistake. It's just frustrating for us because we sat down with people from the state and they just kind of gave us the blank look. And I'm like, okay, how do we fix it? Well, we can't. What do you mean we can't? Well, we don't know how. And it, it's very frustrating for us sure. because when I talked about the guns in the schools and how that's a part of a much bigger picture, the socioeconomic part of it, I know Jana's doing some adult learning stuff with some businesses to help adults here to help increase. I mean, the community as a whole is very giving from the churches to the service groups to the media and everything. But when you come in, a lot of people will say, okay, if we're going to get a dean's plan back here, for instance, what's your school system like if they want to move here? And they see that B, 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 D. Well, hey, 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 what happened? And that's just not a true indicator of who we are. And again, that was Rochester School Board President Brad Weaver. We'll be back with a look at your full weather forecast after this. If you're planning a wedding in the coming year, Rochester Greenhouse, 412 West 11th Street, offers free consultation and offers the most creative and beautiful wedding flowers. Stop by and refresh your home with new cash and carry spring flowers, silk arrangements, and gifts. Next door, Brooch Boutique has received all the great looks and transitional fashions for spring in sizes small to plus. There's new arrivals every day. So shop Rochester Greenhouse and Brooch Boutique. Two stores, twice the shopping fun. Your Fulton County REMC is proud to offer the new Faster Exceed satellite internet service. They can now connect customers to their fastest satellite internet service ever with broadband speeds up to 12 megabytes per second. For homeowners with fewer options for internet service or who live in rural areas, there's no better option than Exceed Broadband. Share photos remarkably fast. Enjoy better video chat with less jitter. Send and receive files quickly. Exceptionally fast web browsing and email. Listen to streaming music. If you're ready for a fast 
faster internet connection, you're ready for Exceed Broadband. Call 574-223-3156 today to learn more about the amazingly fast Exceed Broadband service offered by your local Fulton County REMC, your touchstone energy provider. And now take $50 off all new Exceed internet installs with your Fulton County REMC. Call them today. And again, we are sitting at 42 degrees under cloudy skies here in downtown Rochester. Culver is at 41. The Grissom Aeroplex is at 41 as well. We see a chance of rain before 5 this afternoon, then a chance of rain and snow after that, and we have a high near 41, which we have beat. Tonight, rain and snow likely before 2 a.m., then a chance of rain, a cloudy sky otherwise, and a low around 32. Could see some new snow accumulation of right around an inch. Tomorrow, mostly cloudy, a high near 41. We see some northwest wind gusts up around 30 miles per hour. Tomorrow night, a slight chance of snow before 2 a.m., mostly cloudy otherwise, a low around 24, and some north wind gusts up around 25 miles per hour. On Saturday, it'll be mostly sunny. We have a high near 36, a low around 22. Sunday, mostly sunny, a high near 36, and a low around 30. And then on Monday, we have a chance of rain and snow possible throughout the day, a high near 45, and a low around 30. Again, 41 degrees at the Grissom Aeroplex, 41 in Culver, 42 here in downtown Rochester. And this has been a look at the forecast for Rochester and all of north central Indiana. The news today was brought to you by Rochester Greenhouse, corner of 11th and Fulton Streets. They are your full-service hometown florist. And by your Fulton County REMC, home of the Exceed Broadband Connection. Fulton County REMC, your touchtone energy provider. For WROI News, I'm Paul Zartman. Do you have the WROI News Tip of the Week? When you see or hear news happening, call 223-6059. If you have the top tip of the week, we'll pay you $10. That's 574-223-6059. 223-6059.